Hello internet, my name's Y Dragons and I'm actually starting a timer uh, because I'm going to play an hour's worth of this particular mod survival pack. This is called Crash Landing and we don't have a lot of time so we're going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing I want you to do is I want you to type in slash game rule mob with a capital G griefing false slash game rule mob Oh, I got it all in capital letters. My apologies. It goes to show you that I was actually typing it. I was looking down at my keyboard. Dang it. Uh, mob griefing false. I do this every time. This will stop creepers from blowing up your crap, basically. Also, HQM quest, as is stated above in the blue sign. Slash H. Double. That will start your quest book. All right. So basically, what we're gonna do is, is I'm going to shut up and I'm going to just get started right away. Please follow along if you wish. Uh, if you've already done this stuff, what the fuck? Get out of inventory. If you've already done this before, then by all means, go ahead and just fast forward a little bit. I don't know if I'll have an indication or not uh, on where to go, but. Uh, typically, uh, if you've played this map before, you know how just how difficult the damn thing is, and what a pain in the ass it can be. Uh, so, with that being said, uh, I will talk to you later.
Alright guys, as you can see, I pretty much wasted the last bit of my water, unfortunately. Um, before I die, I want to make sure I go over a couple things with you. If I had gotten ahead of schedule and made more, uh, and sifted more sand, I probably could have gotten more iron. There's four blocks there, and I could have basically made a um, pair of clippers and gotten the tree done so that sucks and my, me dying did not help out a bit because we lost a lot of energy in the process I don't think this will help me out any but I'll give it a shot uh, right now the biggest problem is water without water we're pretty much saturating ourselves I thought maybe I could get away with doing salt water, but it didn't work out too well. Um, so as you can see, I mean, I can hydrate myself, that's the easy part. But I'm still dehydrated, I'm still overheating, so like I can sit here and I can drink the salt water to get me dehydrate, to get me hydrated back up, right? I mean, I can sit here all day. 40%, 50%, but I had the debuff put on me, so I'm pretty much screwed unless I can get some major water. The other uh, problem is is that I don't have the opportunity to get uh, the yeah, see dehydration. Look how fast we're going down. Maybe if I get inside, maybe that'll help a little bit. I doubt it. So for every tick, it looks like it goes down and again our camel pack is empty so we're gonna be automatically having heat stroke even though I disagree with that completely yeah I disagree with that if I'm in the shade if I'm away from the Sun I shouldn't be heat stroking um, uh, the idea was to get enough iron to make a clipper and to make um, make a what is it called damn this heat stroke uh, to make a um, but this is where I screwed up at right here uh, I was trying to figure out where the lava was actually gonna be at and the idea behind it was was that I would oh now it now it updates awesome um, the idea would be that the water would flow I would get a bucket, the water would flow, and then come in here. So I may do that still. I don't know yet. Um, but first things first is, if you ever play this map, and you do like I did, go after water first. Um, but the problem is, is when you, when you try to go after water, is the mere fact that you can't get water unless you have stone. So maybe I should have went ahead and uh, just pounded out and got the water uh, got well you really can't get the water unless you have a bucket can't get a bucket unless you cook the bucket yeah so you would have to literally somehow yeah I'm gonna die so I don't even know why I'm doing this at this point um, I'm just gonna end it uh, but uh, yeah that's crazy there's actually a way that you can drag water to the location of the um i'll get it out in a minute guys where you can drag it to the to the lava but i would i think i'd rather preferably sit there and sift and get the iron blocks and get the stone because I think you need like 23, 24 stone and you can do it. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I apologize if it seemed like I was moving this thing along fast. It's actually an hour long and then I'm trying to scrooge down as quickly as possible. So if things went by fast, it was probably because of that. So uh, next time you see me, I'll actually have everything done and organized and hopefully uh, working on getting stone together because once we get a stone furnace we can actually uh, create our um, 
um, our clippers. That's the important thing is clippers. So maybe I will have to drag a line of water to the location and uh, get that going. So thanks again, guys. I appreciate it for everything you guys do for me. Um, leave likes and comments down below if you so wish. But remember, we do this for fun, not for profit, and not for comments. So if you'd like leaving a comment, leave a comment. If you tell me what I'm doing right, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Hell, tell me anything. Just leave a dot. All right. Bye.